Let's have us some coffee. Wow, you ridiculously ugly. Ah! Uh. Ah! Oh! Horse! Get the fuck out of here, motherfucker! Get your dope out of here. Bullshit! Then, when tens of thousands have gathered in the park, we're going to march on the town hall. Razzle, the people have spoken, and they have said no, not in my town. So folks, if you're listening and want to make a difference, get yourselves down to the you park and prepare to bring democracy back to the people. So, what's this rally about, Jeff? It's about people standing up and being counted. It's about the future. It's about telling those morons in the suits, no thanks, not in my town. Not while I have a breath in my body and hope in my soul. I will not, I cannot let this pass. Let what pass? It's about grabbing the town by the balls and saying, listen, son, time to put up or shut up. No more Mr. Nice Guy. No more easy solutions to difficult problems. It's about what it means to be an American. It's about giving something back. Giving what back, Jeff? Hope, dreams, 
Belief. Belief in what? I mean, look, Jeff, I, I admire your passion. Really, I do. But what will people be marching for? What, what's your rally about? It's about justice, Mr. Lowe. A chance to shine and make a difference. About thousands of people walking side by side as Brother March. Only one thing on their mind. The chance to make a difference. Bring your friends. Nothing shows a man how much you mean to him more than the chance to walk together for justice. Bring your kids. They can paint signs and we'll even have a face painter and a vegan barbecue. Bring your parents. Dude, even the elderly care about tomorrow. I understand that. It sounds like a great rally, but we're not a political station and you haven't really told us why people should do this. What is it about? Look, look, do you want to help or not? I don't know what I'm helping. You're helping America. What kind of patriot are you? It's a rally. You don't know what it's for, do you? It's for hope. Please come, everybody. It'll be real good. All right, you fight the power, brother. Say, later on in the show, if you're into uh, health foods or martial arts, we'll have a special guest just for you. This guy's really special. Kind of like a romantic cruise, but he can't walk on water. All right, let's go to the phones. Hello, caller. You're on Chatterbox. Huh? <laughs> you're on Chatterbox. What's on your mind? Oh, wow. I can't believe it. <laughs> Do you have a question? Dude, I call every day and I never get through this. Amazing! You do a great show, man. <laughs> Thanks. What's uh, what, what, what's up? Oh man, I'm serious. Really great. You're like a total inspiration. <laughs> and exactly what have I inspired you about? Well, okay. Right now, I live at home, but pretty soon. This cut is just my style. You ain't gonna catch me, bitch! Ain't you got a bag you can put on your face? Go crawl back under a rock! This cut- Oh! oh. Homies, over here! Hey, dudes over here! I ain't no banger! Ah! 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 Do shit, dude. Give me a break. I ain't no gang banger. Give your boy a little space, huh? All right, sister, go tell somebody else. Yeah, whatever. You looked at yourself recently? Go on, fool, out! <coughs> ah! Uh-huh. Sometimes I gotta roll alone, all right?
don't make me shoot too hard. And I encourage everyone listening out there on Chatterbox to buy my book and learn how organic food and martial arts can help you too. <laughs> and I encourage anyone who needs a doorstop or booster seat to buy it as well. Let's see who's on the phones. Glad though, this is your final warning. Do not make me go into my dragon's dance. <laughs> Hello, caller. You are on the air. Hello, Reed. I bought your book. It really saved my life. Why, thank you. I wanted to ask about chapter 29, yoga, not yogurt.